the convener of NSPPD, what God cannot do does not exist, Stream of Joy International Ministries celebrates his 42nd birthday in Grand Style as Gospel Minister Moses Bliss joins in the celebration. All that juicy stuff you'll get to know in this video. You are welcome to my channel. I'm Ami React over here. I do just I do reactions and all that good stuff. Kindly do well by liking the video. Kindly do well by subscribing to the channel. Pastor Jerry Az, the convener of NSPPD, what God cannot do does not exist, celebrated his 42nd birthday in Grand Style. Over here, we wish Pastor Jerry Az a happy birthday. We wish him long life. We wish him prosperity. We wish him all of God's goodness, all of God's mercies. And we pray that his ministry will continue to flourish as he continually leads many to Christ. That he will not fall by the wayside and that the ministry God has placed in his hands will not also fall by the wayside. In Jesus' name, amen. Pastor Jerry Eze took to his Instagram page to celebrate himself with this word that says, Another birthday. Lord, thank you for helping me. Lord, thank you for showing me mercy. If there be any trophy, I lay it all at your feet. I love you, Lord. Wow. What a beautiful way to celebrate your birthday. You all know over here, I'm one person that believes that birthdays should be celebrated with prayers because birthdays are very auspicious days in the life of anyone. As Moses Bliss, Gospel Minister Moses Bliss, took also to his Instagram page after celebrating his wife's marriage birthdays, um, no post, he also took to his Instagram page to say, Happy birthday, dear Papa, a real Jerry AZ. I thank God every day for the gift of you for our generation. Thank you for being entirely sold out to the gospel of our Lord Jesus. Thank you for all you are to me. You will continue to go from strength to strength and from glory to glory. In Jesus' name, amen. These were the sweet words of Moses Bliss to Pastor Jerry AZ today on his birthday. You all know a lot of controversies have been surrounding Pastor Jerry AZ lately with those saying um, his ministry isn't genuine and those saying he's doing ministry for the money and a lot of controversies that have been surrounding this man. But one thing I love about people is that despite the stones that are thrown at them, they pick up those stones and build a paradise for themselves. Yes, I remember when Abel Damina came out to say what God cannot do does not exist. And he said, oh, what God cannot do actually exists. And I'm like, to me, Abel Damina doesn't really understand the motive or the message behind Pastor Jerry's what God cannot do does not exist. He's not saying there are things God cannot do. No, it's not like a, a literal word. It's a word that has deep meanings to it. Meanings like there are no blessings God cannot give you. There are no lifting God cannot give you. There are no prosperity God cannot give you. Then you know, you know, no matter how bad you think you are, God can still use you. You understand? He wasn't really saying, oh, what good God cannot do does, no, does not really exist like that. Unlike the way Abel Damina took the whole thing out of the, you know, proportion. But it is well, as a gospel minister, you must always, um, you know, see things. You must always see things that will make you just sit down and start seeing yourself. Is the calling worth it at the end? But the truth is, the calling is worth it. That's all I have for you in this video. Feel free to wish Pastor Jerry Eze a happy birthday in the comment section. I remain let me react over here. I did just, I do reactions and all that good stuff. I will definitely see you in my next one, guys. Bye.